And what's happening everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I appreciate you tuning in again. As you see, the table's set up a little bit differently because I brought one of my friends home with me. This is Larnold, my big ol' bullhead catfish. <clears throat> and he is slightly having some issues adjusting to the move. Um, I had him at my mom's house and it was a little rough to take care of him. A lot of fish were getting neglected, so I actually set free two other channel cats that I had and a bluegill so if you're interested in seeing that I recorded all that I just uh, I don't know if I'm gonna release the video or not so tank isn't set up as you see it's not even all the way full things like that just trying to get them adapted to it but right now we're gonna focus on this you clicked on the video for this reason we're gonna be opening this reviewing that but for now I want to show you the stuff that I found today found some good stuff um, first stop, I went to Target and I found these two red editions right on top in their little dump bin on the side. Super cool. Love the sand blaster. It's a big old Ford Raptor. Um, my buddy Josh at Josh's Hot Wheels Addiction actually found this one. And I wasn't necessarily jealous. I was just like, dang, I hope I could find that. And lo and behold, there it is. Um, then I actually hit another store and there was a dump bin. I found one of these 70 Dodge Chargers. I said 69 to him whenever I told him which one I found. Um, and I picked this one up on a crappy card just because I want to open it because I do have one. And then I noticed the white right there has a little bit of damage on it past the Mopar sticker to the right. Very minuscule, but you can notice it. Always be checking um, the qual quality of the vehicle. And I found another one of these land speeders. It's like my second one now. May or may not open that one. Not too sure. Um, and then these two were super cool to find. I never found these in the wild. My girlfriend actually bought this one for me. Hopefully not at like scalper prices. But uh, the car is not in the best shape. This one's a little bit better. That one I'll definitely keep on card. So we'll probably open up one of these two. Um, I'll leave that for another video. If you guys are interested in that, let me know. But uh, let's go ahead and get right into this 32 Ford and the Speedways. Very cool. Team transport set. I got some more premium vehicles sitting out here as well as over there. And I'll be putting this in the little scene with it. Gotta set this whole table back up. But for right now, we got the catfish in there. If you guys want to see more about him, I have a video on my channel somewhere of him. But uh, I'll try to post some more as it goes. Hopefully, fingers crossed, he will adapt to the move just fine. So let's get right into the premium team transport set. Alright, so here we go. Cut it open just like that so I can keep the card. I love doing that. So here we go. Let's get these out of here. Also a little bit of a disclaimer. I'm sorry if I've been behind on emails and other things such as that. Been having some stuff going on. Been a little bit busy even though it doesn't seem like it with how many videos I pump out. A lot of them are already pre-recorded and things like that. So uh, I apologize. If I'm not getting back to you, leave a comment or shoot me another email. Um, I do apologize. So let's get right into this. We're going to look at the 32 Ford first. This thing is awesome. I mean, I love the kind of matte looking orange color it has. 32 on the side. It's got a Moon Eyes tampo there. Some nice detail. Look at the meats on there. Those big old tires look awesome. Great detail. Even the grill has some black touched in there to make it look a little bit better. A metal on metal casting. And this particular team transport set is super nice. Um, I've got everything except for the BMW on the far left. Um, I have seen it in stores. I just haven't pulled the trigger on it. I probably will um, just to get the whole set. So that is super cool to have this one. It's a cool rolling vehicle. Look at it go, actually. Great roller over the matchbox. Whoa, almost off the table. Look at that. Great rolling rubber tire car. Got to race that one at some point. And here is the Speedways. Now this looks like a 30s to 40s model truck. I'm not very good with 30s to 40s, even 50s era. Heck, even 60s I have some trouble with. Um, I'm a little bit better with 70s and onward vehicles. But uh, this is super cool. I mean, metal on metal, even this is metal. A very, very cool transporter I'm not sure what truck this is based off of uh, maybe an old Mac or something I'm not too sure when Mac was was created I do love my semis but I'm not hundred percent knowledgeable on them 
But uh, man, this thing looks great. I love the color. And so this is how it would go, driving down the street. Let's move this stuff out of the way so he can pull over here, park next to a little auto center there. So that's super cool. I appreciate it if you guys watch the video all the way through. Also, let me know if you want to see some more stuff with the catfish. He's just being a little lazy right now. Like I said, he's uh, adapting to the move. It's probably rather stressful on him, so... Fingers crossed that he's going to be alright. I'm sure he will be, but, um, you know, with the water change and things like that, it just might be a little rough on him, so. Alright, everybody, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to put some of this stuff away and set up some more stuff on the table here. So, thanks for watching. Stay safe out there. Keep on collecting. And I'm out of here.